Hello, my name is Frederick Sadia and I am glad to have participated in the top 35 under 35 as a judge and I uh, was able to uh, judge amongst fellow colleagues on uh, the media and the health category. What inspired me about the list of nominees for this year's um, top 35 under 35 was just the exceptional level of innovation that I saw in the various uh, nominees that were selected in the two categories which where I worked and I remember vividly that there were some very outstanding or you know for me I could appreciate that those nominees that touched me in terms of uh, the the kind of work they were doing I can remember one guy uh, working at the coast who is keen in trying to establish um, a free space or uh, uh, for the young people where they can talk about their uh, uh, sexual reproductive health and you know uh, the kind of uh, the engagement that he has was cutting across working with the private sector and also importantly working with the, the uh, county government of Mombasa and not that just one uh, safe space for the young people but he is working towards establishing some many more uh, safe spaces for the young people and for me this is uh, something that is a story of inspiration. There was also the, another young man who is working in uh, parts of Kajiedo, if I may remember well, and he came up with a program that helps uh, to respond to maternal needs or maternal health of uh, you know women who are struggling walking long distances to get to the places where they access uh, health services and he's come up even with a kind of a chip or you know something that then he can use to monitor or to allow to remind the mothers to be able to go for their uh, checks uh, for their antenatal and of course postnatal care um, in the media category there was this other amazing uh, lady who uh, you know, I, I think they're called a YouTube I, or a media specialist, but came up with a, a YouTube uh, uh, channel where she's uh, kind of sharing a lot of stories. And one story that touched my heart uh, is when this lady uh, shared with us that at one point, if any one of may remember, there was a case at the Pumwani uh, uh, Maternity Hospital, and that when she carried out her story, that it reached so many people that the next day she stated that the county government through the leadership of uh, the governor uh, uh, for Nairobi, uh, Mike Mbubi Sonko, went to the facility to get to know really the status of that uh, uh, case. So when we have such kind of um, young people out there who are doing exceptionally great work, I think top 35 under 35 then is such an exciting platform that, um, you know, uh, personally, as someone who's been also championing the development of the young people, specifically the youth in Kenya, and looking at even the youth dividend, or the youth badge we have uh, in, in, in Kenya, and looking into the future of development, I think we have great potential among our young people. And we could only reassure them uh, by giving them our confidence by telling them you know that there is a way out that they can work to make themselves better